Hey class, in this video I want to show you how to conduct a multi-track recording in Mixcraft using your internal computer microphone. So what you need to do is obviously open up Mixcraft and when you go, when it loads up it should look like this, you just click OK down on that panel there and then we get some tracks to work with okay but the first thing we need to do is we need to ensure that our internal microphone is enabled so we need to go to file up the top then come down to preferences once we're in preferences just make sure that our driver is core audio okay our default recording device is our microphone array real tech high definition audio and your playback device is your speakers now this might differ from computer to computer you might have newer computers or whatever just make sure whatever this is is set to your internal microphone okay once you've done that you can just click ok all right then we want to record um, a track. So we just want to make sure that um, the one selected is our microphone, um, our inbuilt microphone. Then we just hit the arm button. And we can hit the record button down the bottom to start recording. Okay, before we start recording, we want to make sure we have the metronome turned on. You can find the metronome settings down the bottom of the screen. And you want to make sure it's on for recording and you might want to give yourself some counting measures so it doesn't start recording straight away it can give you a in this instance a two bar counting um, before it starts recording so that's pretty handy so you can start right on the first beat so i'm just going to click ok there and for this you're going to want to use headphones and the reason for this is because if sound is coming out of your speakers it's going to be re-recorded and it could create an echo or even worse feedback so make sure you plug a pair of headphones in um, pop them on and then you'll be able to hear the metronome in your headphones to record along to but nothing will be coming out of your computer and so you won't get feedback or an echo okay i'm going to um, the track I'm going to record into and I might need to turn the input down so it doesn't distort you'll have to play around with this do a test recording and see how it goes then I'm going to grab my instrument and I'm going to hit the record button and start recording When I'm ready to record into my second track, all I want to do is unarm the first track I was recording into and choose the next track I wish to record into. So arm that. I'm going to grab my new instrument and I'm going to make sure my cursor is back to the start and I'm going to hit record on my new track. Then once I'm finished with that track, I'm going to arm another track. Might turn this one down so it doesn't distort. I'm going to grab my new instrument and here we go. Make sure the playback head is back to the start. Hit record and we're good to go. So there we go, that's how you multi-track record using Mixcraft and your internal computer microphone. Uh, this will be handy for basically any music assignment that you do or even handy for some other assignments you do at school. So I hope this helped and you're able to do any assignment that you need to do that involves multi-track recording.